Why do our fingers crack? The joints in our fingers are covered by a capsule that contains synovial fluid. Synovial fluid lubricates our joints and provides nutrients for the bone surfaces. When we crack our knuckles, we stretch the joint capsule, which lowers the pressure inside the joint. This creates a vacuum that's filled by the gas that was dissolved in the synovial fluid. When the gas bubbles burst, we hear the cracking sound. Hmm. Why do human palms have lines? The lines on our palms, called ulmer flexion creases, form before birth and serve practical purposes. They help our skin fold and stretch as we grip and flex. Without them, our palms would be too rigid, making fine motor skills difficult. These lines also provide better grip by reducing friction. Though some believe they reveal personality traits or fate, their primary function is biological. Everyone's palm lines are unique due to genetic and developmental factors, much like fingerprints. Hmm. Why do fans make the air feel cooler? A fan doesn't lower air temperature, it just makes us feel cooler. It moves air around, increasing sweat evaporation from our skin, which helps dissipate body heat. The breeze also pushes away the warm air surrounding us, replacing it with cooler air from elsewhere in the room. However, in extremely hot, stagnant air, fans can be ineffective or even counterproductive. That's why proper ventilation is key for maximizing a fan's benefits. <laughs> hmm. What if a thunderstorm grew on our head? Firstly, if a thunderstorm grew on our head, our entire house may get damaged. Hmm. Secondly, if a thunderstorm grew on our head, we may remain wet at all times. Hmm. Lastly, if a thunderstorm grew on our head, even superheroes may start running away from us. Hmm. What if diamonds grew on our head? Firstly, if diamonds grew on our head, our wife may get very, very angry. Secondly, if diamonds grew on our head, our boss may actually start working for us. Lastly, if diamonds grew on our head, we may not be able to balance so many diamonds on our head. Hmm. Why does a camel have long legs? A camel's long legs are perfectly designed for life in the desert. Their height keeps their body farther from the hot ground, helping them stay cool under the blazing sun. Long legs also make walking across sand easier because they take bigger steps, reducing the effort needed to move. These strong, sturdy legs also help camels carry heavy loads over long distances. Hmm. Why do cats lick us? Firstly, cats lick us in order to show their affection towards us. Secondly, by licking us, cats transfer their saliva, which contains pheromones, essentially marking us as part of their territory. Thirdly, licking can also serve as a soothing ritual for cats, helping them calm down when they're anxious or stressed. Hmm. Lastly, Cats sometimes lick us just to get our attention. Why does a caterpillar eat a lot? As larvae, caterpillars consume large amounts of leaves to store energy in the form of fat and nutrients. This intense eating supports their exponential growth, as some species can increase their body mass thousands of times in just a few weeks. Since the caterpillars don't eat during metamorphosis, their earlier binge eating ensures they have the reserves to complete their transformation into a butterfly. Huh? Why does a ship float on water? A ship floats on water due to a principle known as buoyancy. 
Buoyancy is the upward force exerted by a fluid, in this case, water, that opposes the weight of an immersed object, in this case, the ship. Mm. Ships are designed to displace a volume of water equal to their weight. When the weight of the water displaced is equal to or greater than the weight of the ship, the ship floats. This principle allows even very large and heavy ships to stay afloat. Mm.